Hi, Dave Fenoy here with your VO Notebook. I was talking with Ann Ganguza, and the question came up, how do you set your rates? How do you know if you're charging enough or too much as a freelancer? Let's find out. I just got my first cartoon gig from a production company in Singapore. I've auditioned for a secondary role. They like my, my stuff and ask my rates. I know overseas rates are less than U.S. What would be appropriate? This is a pilot for a series. I quoted $400. Would this be in the ballpark? Um, being a freelance uh, and a lady, first, go ahead. Oh, actually, I'm going to say don't automatically assume just because it's overseas or, you know, wherever it is that it's a lower rate. You know, you have your rates and those are rates that you establish that are uh, that 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 are are your fair rates. And so I always say, you know, in the business of negotiation, you know, quote high. I mean, you don't want to quote sky high. That's something completely ridiculous. But, you know, start high because then you can negotiate afterwards. So, you know, I'm all about. Uh, these are my rates and if you know and if you, you you know i i if you will accept them then that's awesome and if you don't that's okay i can say no and find another client that will pay my rates yeah so it, i just kind of made it cut and dry like that um my experience is a little different because i'm generally uh represented by an agent who does my negotiation but from time to time i have to do that and i just base my rates on uh, what I would be getting were my agent booking it. Uh, and then I turn it over to my agent. Uh, but $400, depending on uh, where you're starting, you're not union, uh, and this is the beginning of your career, that may be okay to you. Um, but I have, a, I have a feeling that uh, very often we as artists undervalue ourselves. And uh, so whatever that that uh, money that pops into your mind is, oh, you know, maybe I can get 400 add a few hundred dollars to that. Go for six, yeah. go for eight. Uh, mm -hmm. See what the client says. If they really like you and they say, oh, you know, that's not in our budget. Well, as Ann was saying, now you've got some wiggle room there. Make sure you're charging what you're worth. And I bet you're worth more than you think you are. Do not fall into the exposure trap. But just think of the exposure you'll get. Mm -mm -mm. I'm Dave Fenoy, and this is your VO Notebook.